Okay, let's talk. There is a lot, there's a lot of stuff going on right now, okay? Um, regarding the Jeffree Star situation. Okay, let's talk about that. Put this back for a little bit. So I have seen so much speculation, so many rumors going on, and it's just kind of like, it's just kind of like sick and disgusting and twisted and dark where some of these people's mind go goes uh, when it doesn't have to go that far. You know what I'm saying? Um, Jeffree Star has not posted on social media in a few days now, okay? It's just kind of worrisome because he like lives his life online. The other part of it is that it's no secret that he canceled the tour overseas with Mitchell. Okay, that tour is canceled. Jeffree Star is literally like one, one of the hardest working people in the industry. So for him to cancel a, a work obligation is not normal. So he usually is just always working. So that's when I was like, okay, this is, this is something this is something huge, because why would he cancel, you know? Then, a couple days went by, still no one's heard anything, no, he hasn't posted anything like that. That's when I got worried. So I reached out, I personally sent a message, no response, which is fine, because when I go through stuff, I don't want to be bothered either. That's just the truth all day long. Now, Jeffree Star today, finally um, reached out. So here's what he put on Twitter. That literally right there could mean so many things, right? Like nobody knows what's really happening, but that right there could mean so many things. So for example, um, the last time that we've seen Jeffree Star on social media, he was at uh, the vet office taking care of one of the pets, something about I think one of them either was sick or had a sprained ankle or something like that. Who knows, it could be something much more worse. Like We don't know. But I don't think, I don't think it has something to do with the dogs, so I'm not sure, you know? But what is really scary to me is that looking online and seeing so many people just speculating and starting rumors and going to this dark place and what if this happened? What if that happened? What if, like, guys, if you don't know, like you putting that out there just makes it worse, right? And it, I know it sucks being Jeffrey in the sense that like going through something, whatever it is, having all these messages and bombarding with thousands and thousands, if not millions of mess, my cat right here, of messages of people just being like, I you know, uh, hope you're okay, what's going on? Is this happening, is this true? And all these rumors, like, wait, sorry about that, I got a phone call. But I'm pretty sure he just wants to like, just be like a normal person. It's like, let me deal with this without having so many people messaging me or, or bothering me or whatever you wanna call it. Like, let me, I don't know what it is but let me just go through this process in peace, right? It's like, all I just want is peace. And it's just, I don't know. I just think it, it sucks, like, cause you, you want, I'm just, I, I don't know. I'm just kind of worried about it. And I'm getting so many messages about people, uh, even more now, even more messages now, people are saying, I'm, I'm really worried. Like at first I was like, you know, okay. But now I'm like really, really worried because he hasn't posted anything. He hasn't posted a video. He hasn't did a Snapchat. And he did that tweet and then it went away. But based on that tweet, it could mean so many different things, okay? Because I see a lot of speculation online and I just feel like it kind of like needs to stop because it's getting like, it's going to a place that it doesn't have, have to go. That's just what I, and, and like, I'm making this video because I'm getting so many messages, like, have you spoke to Jeffrey? Do you know what's going on? What's really going on? I don't know, girl, okay? I don't know. I'm worried. 
as a friend, as a subscriber, as a fan, I'm worried. I'm worried too. I think a lot of people out there on social media are worried about it too. And they want to know what's going on. But at the same time, you have to understand that people, everyone's different. And so you should just like give people their space and give, give them their time and let them go through whatever it is you're going through, let them go through it. And then when they're ready, they will come back on social media and talk about it. Because it's true. I don't think that this is part of some plan to launch a product or anything like that. Um, I do think that he really wanted to go overseas to go um, do the master classes and the makeup classes and stuff like that. And to cancel that, that's just like huge. I don't know, I'm sad. I'm sad because we don't know what's going on and there's all these rumors going on. It's just getting ugly and it's just like, uh, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. Um, I don't know. What, I don't know what else to say other than that. All right, I got another phone call. Just with anything, like just keep them in your prayers. Send positive energy. Send your love. Send your respects, condolences, whatever it is that you feel, because nobody knows what it is. But the speculation I feel needs to stop. I think ultimately, and anyone would be in that position. They just want peace. And, you know, peace and serenity and that and that whole thing. So just, I don't know, just kind of just be mindful of what, like, what you put out there sometimes. And um, I just, I hope and pray that everything is fine. And that if it's not fine, I hope and pray um, if you, too, they can make it through it and everything will be okay. That, if that makes sense. For those of you who, who believe in a higher power and stuff. But I'm in this video here. Um, Thank you guys for hearing me out and watching. And if anything else happens, then we'll let you know. All right.